Another bacterial disease is bacterial leaf streak. It is caused by Santomonas oryzae patubar oryzae cola. Yung isa kanina ay patubar oryzae, ito naman ay oryzae cola. This disease occurs in areas with high temperature and high relative humidity. It is transmitted, it is reported to be transmitted through seeds and infected stubbles and can affect plants from maximum tillering to panicle initiation. These yons start as small translucent streaks and enlarge lengthwise and may advance laterally over the larger veins. The lesions often qualis, so katulad nito, nagkukwalis sila, so lumalaki, mag-akala mo parang blight na siya. And at later stages of development, the entire leaves will turn brown and eventually die. Under humid conditions, yellow water droplets of bacterial host may be observed on the surface of the leaves. Ewan ko kung makikita ninyo, ito, mga ano yan, yan, ito mga maliliit na parang mga bilog na yan, these are uh, tiyatawag na bacterial host. Yan. So we can manage uh, bacterial leaf streak yung, kung ano yung disease management natin doon sa bacterial leaf blight pwede rin siyang gamitin para dito sa bacterial leaf streak. Halos pariho din ang uh, mga control strategies or management strategies. Okay? Resistant variety, again, resist, the use of resistant varieties is the most economical and effective means to control bacterial blight. But because of new virulent races, integrated approach may be more appropriate ano, ano itong mga integrated approaches natin? Balance fertilization, ensure good drainage, remove weeds, host, and plow under stubble, straws, and volunteer uh, seedlings, proper deployment of resistant varieties in the field. So mayroon nga tayong resistant varieties, pero dapat ay proper ang pag-deploy, ang pagtanim. Ibig dahil maraming ang races, ibig sabihin, huwag kang magtanim ng variety na doon sa, sa lugar na kung nasusip, naging susceptible yung variety because of the, present, the presence of yung mga uh, races 